Here's some basic instructions on how to use the wireless microphone. First, you need all the parts. Make sure you have the mic and the transmitter, receiver, headphone, antenna, and the mic out cable. They should be find, found in the case with the camera. First, take the transmitter and plug in the microphone. You'll then place the microphone onto the lapel, clipping it onto the person's clothing. You can either have them hold on to the transmitter or you can clip it onto their belt. Next, the receiver needs to have the antenna installed. You can screw it onto the top. We take it off because it's easier to place into the camera bag. On the side, there's two connectors. One is a mic out. This is the mic out that goes into the camera. So plug it into there. The other is a headphone out that you can listen to the recording while it's being made. There's one on the camera that's better to use. Next, you need to plug the mic into the camera. There's a little red port near the lens plug it into there. It'll overtake the mic internal to the camera and that way you won't have two microphones running at the same time. On the side there's two switches. One is the on off switch. Make sure that that is on on both the receiver and the transmitter. And the other switch is an AB channel switch that allows you to have a different channel than somebody else. So you'd want to make sure it's either both on A or both of them are on B. The headphones are best to go into the side of the camera. You can bring your own headphones with you. Anyone with a standard small headphone jack will do. Plug it in to the side of the camera and this will allow you to listen to the recording while it's being made and also listen to playback so you can check that the recording worked well. You're going to want to make sure that the battery is fully charged on the camera so that you don't run out of battery halfway through your shoot. You open the door on the side and then pop out a little port at the top. Plug in the charger. It does take quite a few hours to get the charge to full since the battery is a high capacity battery. Finally, there's one more cable you need to know about. This is the USB cable that allows you to connect it to the computer. Plug it in on the right hand side. There's a small door that opens. This allows you to connect it to the computer so that you can download the material to Final Cut Pro. I hope that helps. It's how to set up the wireless microphone.